Hello guys, welcome back. Hogging face today, uh, introduce the Hogging Chat Assistant. Build your own personal assistant in Hogging Face Chat in two clicks. Similar to OpenAI GPTs, you can now create custom versions of Hogging Face Chat, right? An assistant is defined by name, avatar, and description. Any available open LLMs like Llama 2 or Mixtrol, custom system meshes to control the behavior, different meshes starters. If you haven't uh, watched previous videos about open GPTs, I have created videos about create custom GPT of open AIs, also open GPTs from Langchain and the Racks from Llama Index, which kind of does the same thing. But this hogging chat is next level it's similar to as it is mentioned here open ai gpt so this video will be in three parts first i will show you what is hogging a chat first if you are new to hogging chat and then the next one is i will just show you how to explore the existing assistants and how to use it and the third will be how to create your own assistant let's get started okay the link will be in the description of the video but here philip has already provided the link as it is here hogging face.co chat assistants i will just click here and it takes me to the website right and i'm not logged in here but this is the ui how it looks like but first let me show you or navigate you through the ui i have already created the video earlier but this is the hugging chat right on the on the new here you can create a new chats this is the assistant by the way let me go to the hugging chat right and yeah you can just go here and ask the questions that is similar to chat gpt you can go here and change the models this is the setting page and these are the examples already being provided we will create something similar to this when we create our own let's say assistant and here you need to log in first if you you can use this without login also but it will restrict you to do some queries and then it will ask you to log in so better log in here and the theme you can use the light and the dark theme and this is the assistance where it is shown all the assistance that is being created publicly and this is the settings that i just showed you before right and down here if you go to the main page now uh, so here it is also shown which model is being used if you click this it will again take to the settings page. so yeah this is all the things and if you want to know maybe let's say uh, something about the current model you can click this link it will take you to the hogging face website and it will explain you what that model is all about so the first phase of the video is completed now the second phase now is uh, let's explore the existing assistance first i will log in so i suggest you to create the account and login i have already created the account so i'm logging so as you can see here data science basics and this is the assistant right because i have chosen this assistant but before i will just show you i will first go here and go to this one i will remove the assistant first because i have already used that assistant so yeah i'll go again to the assistants now you can choose one of the assistants from here right i can choose again the clone of hogging face cto and it says here okay clone of hogging face cto trying to scale my productivity by cloning myself please talk with me and this is created by Julian, right? And you can do cancel or you can start having the conversation. Yeah, start chatting. So now as you can see here, it is shown here. And here are some of the examples as I showed you in the before also. We will also create something like this. And now you can just go here and chat. You can say hi and it will reply you hello. And as you can see here, the model being used also is shown here, meaning that the UI now is the same the thing different here is just the just the prompt or system prompt or it is the different uh, let's say the assistant right and if you want to know what is the system uh, prompt used for by this clone of let's say the hugging face cto you can go on top of this and here you can see that this is now active you can remove which i did before you can report this if you if you find something strange here you can copy this link and send this to someone else so that as it says here uh, share this link for people to use your assistant right and this is the system prompt so you can take uh, help of this system prompt to create your system prompt or system instructions right just take help of this so yeah this is how you can use the existing ones right now how to create your own this is the third part of the video and go to the assistants here on the top create new assistance by the way you need to be logged in again 
you cannot create an assistant without logging in, right? So you create a new assistant and now you can upload your avatar. I will upload from here. I will take the channel data science basics. I will give the name, okay, data science basics description. You can just give whatever descriptions you want. Okay, data science stops just to say random things here just to show you how we can do these things and the what is the model you want to use the models that you can choose are the ones that is provided by hogging chat right you can choose one of the models from here let me go with the mistral uh, 7b instruct you can choose anything and this user start messages is the ones that we see in the main ui the four examples yeah you can just provide here now anything okay Help me debug things and you can say how are you, say random things and here you can say simply chat or let's say provide ML related stops, whatever you want to do. And now this is the instructions, let's say the system prompt, whatever you want to give based on your things, right? So here I will just say that you are a helpful assistant that provides information related to machine learning and let's say ml ops ml ops if you are asked let's say other stops just say i don't know yeah this is what i want to provide but let's see if it if it actually does the thing or not right so i will just say create so now it says that this is public, right? And data science stops. That's what the description I gave. This is the model being used, created by data science basics. And this is the activate because I have, I have been activating the clone of hogging face CTU right now. I will do the activate. Now this is activated. When this is clicked, as you can see here, it's saved automatically. And this is the system prompt or instructions. I will copy this. Why I'm copying this is because now if I say that I close this because this is public, this is active. If I close this, it should appear as, as you can see here, it should appear on the main UI, but we don't see here. Let me refresh the page. Yeah, it is not seen here. I don't know if it is a bug or there is some restriction because this was just introduced today, but you cannot actually see this in the main UI for some reason. Or when this is active, if you are, let's say, creating this, you can just go here and refresh the page once. And if you now go to the main page, it will show you the data science basics. If you are creating this by yourself, this is how you just appear here. And now here is the things that we just created. Help me debug things. How are you provide me ML related stops? I will click this and it will start providing the answer as you can see here. So it is quite fast. And just to check if it just provides us the machine learning and ML of related stuffs, I can just provide something here. Okay, how to create pasta. By the way, it is providing all the informations here. And I can just give thumbs up. Thank you. And how to create pasta. Let's say that if it provides answer or not. Okay, it says that, okay. I apologize for the confusion earlier. However, since you have asked about creating pasta now, here is a simple recipe. Okay, it provides the recipe for me, right? But I just ask it to say, I don't know, but it is not following that. Maybe I need to provide a little bit more system prompt. What if I say that mm, I told you not to provide info other than, let's say, machine learning and ML ops. Okay, it says for the mistake. Now let me ask the same thing, like how to make pasta. Okay, now <laughs> as it says, I apologize for previous response as it was not relevant to machine learning or MLFs. To clarify, here is a brief explanation of how to prepare spaghetti pasta. Okay, it again provides the information. So you can see how LLM works, but maybe... Uh, better system prompt works or maybe then you can just give here okay thumbs down something like this but this is how you created yourself now i copied the link before if you remember in the settings i can go to the data science basics i will copy this i copied that before also now let me just go to uh, normal things i will paste here 
and yeah this is the new things here i can have start start chatting here and now it works as it is and let me also maybe create a new let me go to the new new tab here or new profile and this is not related to the existing one it still works just to show you that okay i try as a guest and start chatting meaning that the link that you copied works everywhere let's say in that way if you are not logged in also it works but if you logged in then it's better so i hope now you get the idea how how to navigate with the hogging chat and then how to use the existing ones and how to create your own uh, own assistants okay that's all i want to show you in this video thank you for watching and see you in the next video